changed dramatically in 30 years. By bringing four artists together, you get four very different views of what's significant in the world today. What's exciting about the Turner Prize is that it holds up four artists that it says are really good. And not only that, it says we're going to discriminate between these four artists and find out which is best. The year that Rachel Whitreed won for House in 1993, I suppose that was the moment when this new British art started to crash in on people's imaginations. It's amazing what you can do with an ENA level art, a twisted imagination and a chainsaw. Yeah, I, I made my dress for the occasion to be at an award ceremony, so I thought I'd better make the effort on the off chance that I win. There's no way when this f my con me. The Secretary for Arts and Culture said I was a, an embarrassment to British culture and a bad role model for young people who wanted to do art. It was a passionate, bloody arena in which artists like Rachel Whitery, Damien Hirst, Tracy Ammon and Steve McQueen, Chris Ophelia all made their bones, as it were, in this very vicious public space. When you're in a group exhibition, people don't really walk around and judge you. They sort of, you know, look at the work and think about it, or they don't really compare it. You can see people going around the show scrutinising everything very carefully because they're trying to grasp what it is that might be good about the work. Martin Creed. Thinking that oh, there is such a thing as the best, that you can, you know, play tricks with you, with your head, you know. The turn is all about having an opinion. It's about responding to the art very directly and, and arguing about it. I think it gets people going still. I think people who come to it find it something that provokes them and makes them talk. Every year there's always a surprise of some kind. People complain because suddenly there's an artist who's working in performance, or they wonder whether the prize will ever go to a painter again. I think the great achievement of the Turner Prize over 30 years is to have given people an opportunity to disagree with each other and to form a view. Not everyone likes contemporary art. I don't expect everyone should, but I think the Turner Prize has given them at least an opportunity to engage with it.